Recently, a coalition of five business organizations came together in the lead up to the federal budget. We joined forces because we share the same objective, creating a better future for all Canadians. From SMEs to Indigenous-owned firms and some of Canada's largest exporters, we represent thousands of businesses employing millions of Canadians. I'm meeting today with Perrin Beattie to hear what's on the minds of his members. Goldie, when I talk to our members, there's no doubt the number one short-term issue that they're dealing with is COVID-19. This is already having an impact on business in Canada. Many retailers are being affected. People in the hospitality sector are being affected. And we're very concerned, particularly about small and medium-sized businesses that need to all have plans to deal with this. On the longer term, there are some pretty pressing issues. So, for example, the question of skills. It doesn't matter where you go in Canada. People say the greatest challenge they have is to attract and to hold people with the skills that they need. We need to have a close collaboration between government, the educational sector, and business to be able to be successful here. Infrastructure is another area where we need to work together, both digital infrastructure and physical infrastructure. The government has a budget to do that. It should be possible for us to focus on the areas that will really drive economic growth. The good news as we look at this budget is that there are measures the government can take now that will have a real impact to get our economy moving. Karen, it certainly sounds like whether one's a small business or a large business, this is the same issue for all of us and we're all in it together. But how do we move this forward? There are 1.3 million businesses in Canada employing tens of millions of people. That's an incredible resource for the government to be able to draw on. I know from my personal experience as a member of parliament and member of cabinet how important it is to be able to take advantage of this expertise. What we need is a willing partner in government. If it's there, business is there, we're anxious to help. We can certainly do it together and I like doing it with you here today. Thank you so much for all your support and your leadership, Perrin. My pleasure. Let's get at it. Let's get at it.